Another new feature that we're quite excited about is the MOT due date and history lookup. So let's select a vehicle and you'll see a new icon appear here once it's enabled. Click on that and you'll see the MOT history and the MOT due date. On 9.1 you get one additional option and that's to remove the individual line. So you can tick several items then when you hit the part F6 button it will preload them into your comparison grid. And what we do is we're going to create a custom button for discs and pads together. So click to add a custom shortcut. It will then make us an empty template where we can put in an icon for the discs. The biggest development in this release is our new accessories catalogue which has support for tools, equipment, car care, consumables and accessories. Now do that with the engine number. So you just right click on it, again it'll say copied, go to your alternative application or document, paste on it and there you go, there's your engine number. Some of the other changes in 9.1 are not huge but improve user experience. For example, the pram screen has been redesigned to make it easier for installations on devices with smaller screens. It is possible that not all features described will initially appear in release 9.1 of AutoCAD. However, it is more likely that additional features will be completed and added before release. Thanks for watching. If you would like to be kept up to date with the ongoing developments at MAM Software, then please follow us on social media, YouTube, and our community portal.